Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Presta Angelisa Septiani, and now I will present my work uh, in making worksheet with Google Slide. Okay, so the model of my exercise is like this. So the first time that the students must do is write their name in this column. Okay, let's see. Okay, write your name. My name. Okay. This is for the example. Okay, so for the second one, the students must uh, read the direction. Okay, so the direction of this exercise is make three sentences of each picture with degrees of comparison positive degree comparative degree and superlative degree okay so do you know what is uh, degrees comparison okay so for the first one i will uh, explain to you about it so let's begin with the positive degree positive degree is a term that relates to adjectives and adverbs or i can conclude that positive degree is adjective or adverb with no comparison Okay, so let's move to comparative degree. So comparative degree is a verb or uh, adjective modified by uh, more or ending in er that is used when comparing two things. And superlative degree, what is superlative degree? So superlative degree is the form of adjective or a verb that ex 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 expresses the highest or a very high degree of quality like that okay so let's begin uh, with the first picture okay the first picture is there are Anna, Ani, Ina and Annie okay and do you know what is uh, the adjective that has a correlation with this picture okay so in this picture there is a centimeter okay there is centimeter it's mean that uh, the adjective that correlates or that relates with this picture is tall, right? Okay, so the adjective one is tall or we can call it or we can conclude that uh, the positive degree is uh, tall, okay? So let's begin or let's write uh, the first sentence here. The first sentence is a uh, positive degree, okay? So uh the positive degree i use the subject is anna because anna is 165 anna is tall enough right okay so anna is tall okay this is the positive degree this is the sentence with the positive degree okay so the second sentence is used a comparative degree okay so uh, the subject is ani or Ina. We can use uh, both to Ani or Ina. But I want to use Ani. Ani or Ina. Yes, that's right. Because they have uh, the same height, right? So I will use Ani. Ani, this is comparative degree. So Ani is taller than Anna, right? Okay, this is the correct one. Let's move to the third sentence, which is uh, which use a uh, superlative degree. So, uh, the most tall or the tallest in this picture is Annie, right? So we can make the sentence like this: Annie is the tallest. Okay, this is the great one. Okay, so let's move to the next picture. Okay, there are Earth, Venus, Mars, Mercury, and Pluto. Okay, so I will use Earth, Venus, and Mars. But you can use uh, Mercury and Pluto too. But I just want to use Earth, Venus, and Mars. Okay, let's make uh, the first sentence. This is... Uh, 
this use a positive degree, right? Okay, so the smallest one is Mars. So I will use Mars as a positive degree. So Mars is, oh yeah, the adjective one of this picture is big, right? Okay, so Mars is big. That's right. Okay, let's move to the second sentence with comparative degree. And then I use uh, the uh, subject with Venus, right? Venus is bigger than Mars. Okay, do you get the point? Okay, I think you get the point. That's right. Okay, so let's move to the third sentence with superlative degree so the third sentence is earth earth is the biggest right so the sentence is earth is the biggest right okay so you must do the exercise like this okay thank you